Hello, Brother Monroe here. Welcome back to Ultimate Admiral Notes. And today, a scenario sent in by Signore Romero on uh, my Discord server. There's a link in the description down below. And um, I'm playing as Spain. Now, it isn't specified the year, but I'm going to give myself a little bit of a tech advantage. So I've got one battleship, and this is supposed to be defending the Philippines. And there's quite a lot of enemy forces coming in. Now, the scenario did say, oh, build a concrete battleship that you won't you you don't get to move but if i can't move then i will just get blown up by torpedoes so um i'm going to go with the spirit of the uh <laughs> um the scenario rather than the letter so spanish modernized dreadnought interesting combination of stuff uh, that tower is better. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, right. Let's get. Get a funnel. Uh, Right. Um, uh, fourteen inch guns. Why? Screw it. Let's use twelves. <laughs> um, Kind of a hmm, yes. I wish that was a twelve-inch gun, but oh well. Uh, the uh, that'll have to do. Can we move all this forward a bit? Come on. Yeah, that's as far forward as I can go. Mm -mm -mm. Actually, can you fit twelve inch gun on top? No. What about ten? No. Only nines. Hmm. I'd like to use some a smaller tower than that. That one could work. Really? Yeah. gun on top there there we go um secondary guns Duh. really no no <laughs> fives yeah i thought it was only fours that could do that yeah it is Wait, was I just holding it over the wrong spot? No, I wasn't. Okay. Behold the double decker guns. <laughs> yes. Um these ones go. Excellent. Good. Right. Uh, two inch guns. Yes. 
Yes. Excellent stuff. Right. That should be enough secondary. <laughs> Starting ranges. Your discretion. Um, yeah, I, I, I don't remember what I said it as, as, as actually. It was whatever it was for the last battle. Probably 15 or something. Um, got a little bit of a four weight offset. So just pull that gun in a little bit. Right, let's get the rest of the ship built out. Um, oil. Pfft. Balanced? Yeah, balanced. 24 knots. I uh, don't need that. Uh, yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. All these things. Um, just gets me... Actually, that's pretty decent. 90%. Right. Gun type. Let's go for... Two powder super heavy shells to make the 12 inch guns as punchy as possible. Um, good instance rangefinder. I'd kind of like to spot the torpedoes. Autoloaders, even though they're heavy. Hydro turrets. It gives me 5% for armor. Um, geez. Let's go with a. Really? Can I, can I go? No. That's <laughs> definitely not. Go for a 16.8. Yeah. Maybe round that off to three. A little bit more on the turret. I'm assuming more horizontal fire than anything else. Uh, maybe just get this up a little bit. Point three, and then there we go. the America. Why not? <laughs> so, Super Hunter, um, I didn't realize it. Uh, you and uh, you were your Discord name, if that makes sense. Um, yeah, so if I have a stationary ship, I will just get wrecked by torpedoes instantly. Like, and it won't be a fun. It won't be a fun video. I promise. <laughs> It'll just be me going, "Oh, I'm going to get wrecked by torpedoes," and I get wrecked by torpedoes. That's that's what happens. Like, if you can't avoid torpedoes, you just get hit by them and sunk. Even with really high anti-torpedo protection, um, the anti-torpedo protection is nowhere near as good as the torpedo techs um, that they can throw at you. Right, uh, two battleships, two heavies, three lights, and two destroyers. Let's go. Enemy smoke is spotted to the north. So yes, I do change scenarios. Sorry about that. Pretty big splashes. But yes, I do have <laughs> super duper duper firing technically with that little two inch gun on the top. But um, I, I only consider it to be super firing with the main guns. Obviously, the two inch gun is a secondary gun. Right, let's see what the Japanese brought. What? 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 Why? Why? Why are there only six guns? What's with this little tiny secondary and nothing else? Why is this on a barbet? Why are there no casemates? Either. Just... Boom. Can we agree that that's a horrible design? Please, chat. 
AI couldn't be asked. Yeah, pretty much. And we have some form of cruiser. So a little bit more sensible. Another cruiser. Destroyer? No, light cruiser. Wow. That's interesting. Kind of, kind of cool. sign of the destroyers yet. The secondary tower's on the lower deck. Yeah, it is. Down here. Like a destroyer, basically. Just <laughs> the double-decker guns. <laughs> No, no, it's a light cruiser. It's a light cruiser, but it's built more like a destroyer. It's uh, one of the unique Japanese hulls. Hello. What are you? No, you're another one of those light cruisers. That's presumably a heavy cruiser then. All right. Still no IDs on any of the ships, so I'm just gonna. Oh no, we do. We do have some IDs. Uh, enemy battleships. Uh, pretty. Oh, minimum bulkheads. Okay. And 16 inch guns. Maximum bulkhead, 8 inch gunned heavy cruisers. And we still haven't ID'd the very strange light cruisers yet. Here's a destroyer. Maximum bulkhead, six inch guns. They do have torpedoes, actually. Oh, so they do. Right there. Interesting. Right, now goes the light cruiser. Oh, hello. It's like they got ahead of me in five torpedoes. Hard to start with. How many of those do you carry? Twelve. Of course you do. Why wouldn't you carry twelve? At least we can spot the damn things. Hold on. More of them coming out. Presumably from... Yeah, the heavy cruisers. Who also carry in a ludicrous number of those. But they only, do only get two shots, apparently. And they carry 24 base. No, that can't be right. they got two launches, though. And 
they've just fine as well. Keep turning. Right. Head midships. See if we can uh, get the drop on this light cruiser. stuff. Yeah. Then see if we can take down the destroyer. Do, 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 do. Yeah, immense deck armor is is not as good as you would you would think. <laughs> Basically all that would happen with loads of deck armor and standing still is the enemy would sail up to you, torpedo you and then shoot you through the through your non-existent belt armor. Like, you would just die horribly. <laughs> Looks like we're focusing on that heavy cruiser now. That's fine. Good hit. Maximum bulk hit, so, so those things aren't going to be simple to take down. Nice hit. like uh, some torpedoes are going to be reloaded in a moment. Good hit. Yeah, they fired. There are the torpedoes. Flooding hit. Now then, I'm trying to think which ship is our best bet. Main guns, will you stop wasting ammunition? There's a problem with autoloaders. Because I'm so slow, I can't really catch up to them very easily, so I kind of need them to uh, stop running away like cowards. Or flash firing themselves to death if they're a destroyer. That's helpful. Fired. Bye bye. Ooh, ooh. Yep. Go on, waste your torpedoes. Let the secondary guns get to work. Oh, hello. They're fine in an annoying fashion. Uh, poop. <laughs> I'm going to have to turn this away, I think. And I'll even use manual rudder control just for uh, the complainers. Aha! 
There you go. Right, all guns on the Natori. See if we can't. Ah, she yet yeah, she did fire a second salvo. Got any of those left, you sneaky little sausage? I don't think you do. Right, get wrecked. Ba 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 da 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 da. No, you could use the right clicking. I can only exclusively use the right clicking. I never use manual rudder. I guess it depends what game you come from. Oh shit, where do those come from? Well, I can't dodge torpedoes when I don't see them coming. <laughs> it's like the heavy cruisers are using the last of their torpedoes. Well, it's a good job I put the protection on. Could hit on the Natsuri. I think pretty much crippled it. And dead. Okay, lovely. It's come about. Do 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 do. You're not Wowsery. If you're watching this on YouTube and you haven't checked out uh, Wowsery's uh, channel, he does. Uh, Ultimate Emerald Dreadnought's content. I have an evil cackle. Yeah, uh, I'd accept that. <laughs> so those of you who use manual rudder, or it's instinctual for you to use this little slider over here, um, what games, what, what, what naval combat games are you used to playing? Or what games you used to play? I'm I'm very curious. I would be an excellent dictator. <laughs> Although the problem with dictators is they nearly inevitably become not nice because you know it's how the system works. But yeah, so Megami has no torpedoes. Aka has eight. Just need to steam into range. Atlantic Fleet, Pacific Fleet, World of Warships. Okay. See, I played none of those. <laughs> I'm coming from Battlefleet Gothic and Empire Total War and things like that. Like this, going here to adjust the rudder is so counterintuitive to me. Like, I actually, I have to f really think to use this. Are you guys just going to stay at range? Because it's really annoying if you are. I mean, I'm cool with you guys wasting all that 16-inch ammunition, but... How many times did they hit us with that? Twelve times. Wow. <laughs> Taking about 120 hits off the 8-inch guns from the heavy cruisers. Hmm. <laughs> really, what's the accuracy on these guys? 5%? 4%? Five 5.9? 5.9. Okay. Our own accuracy is only 4.2. <laughs> no, I don't think about my combat actions. That's kind of the point. Um, like, it, 
It's I like that they have both. It's the same with the full reverse. I don't tend to think of the full reverse very often to use it. He's Lord Nelson Incarnate. That's very kind of you. But uh, yes, pretty much. What is this thing you call maneuvers? Right. Let's uh, get all guns on the Megami. Because we're, we're at what? 6.7 kilometers now. And... Oh, hello, torpedoes, my old friend. I was... I checked the Acker. I swear I checked the Acker. Before I started turning again. Alright, let's see if we can go through the gap. That the last of the Akka's torpedoes? No, she's got four more left. Probably loaded into the other tube, but I think the game lets you uh, swap them over. No, that's a miss. You missed. <laughs> right. Oh, goodbye, Magami. Next, we can try and finish off the Akka. Oof, come on. There we go. It's more like it. Bum, 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 bum. Come on, guys. It's a good set of damaging hits, but nothing, uh, nothing vital. Oh, that's more like it. Double flooding hit. Still all on the rear of the ship, but uh, all of her engine spaces have been disabled or flooded or set on fire or something. And her steering. Just need to keep an eye on those torpedoes. Could you please sink her before she fires those? That would be a big help. Come on. How were none of those hits? <laughs> How? It's just unreasonable. Yep, she uh, she was able to move the torpedoes over to the. Um, magically able to move the torpedoes over, which is so unfair. That is, however, the very last set of torpedoes the Japanese have. And down goes the heavy cruiser that was carrying them. Good stuff. Right. Now, just got those battleships to deal with. Hit. Oh, 
Oh my god! <laughs> what? What the flip? Was that the 9 inch gun? No, it wasn't. It was a 12 inch gun. Main gun, pen, 18 damage. Only 18, but um, caused a little bit more damage. Bye bye, 16 inch turret. <laughs> Glorious. Who needs 14 inch guns? 12 inch guns are better. <laughs> you are you, Joe. Next on the uh, list. Minimum arcade battleships. It's a 16 inch shell. Oh. That's a lot of flooding. More flooding. That might be a turbine amount of flooding, actually. Bye bye. <laughs> wow. Okay. Well, that was a good one. Interesting. Who knew? 12 inch guns. <laughs> it does look a bit like a porcupine, this thing. All those gun turrets sticking out of it. Um, still, though, proved surprisingly effective. Um, even against enemy battleships, although much helped by them having minimum bulk heads. Um, anyway, those of you on YouTube, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you again soon for some more Ultimate Admiral Dreadnoughts. Bye bye.